Senator Modi. Honorable Senators, I rise today to pay tribute to my friend, colleague, and office neighbor, the Honorable Senator José Foreni Singh. For all of us, Senator Foreni Singh represented kindness, elegance in manner and approach. She led with her keen intellect and brilliance as an orator, shining her light on all of us. She was a gentle force and a strong voice within the Senate, and her passing has been a great loss for our institution and for Canada. When I was appointed to the Senate, Jose enveloped me with her kindness, her realism, and her wisdom. She was the first person who contacted me to welcome me within a day of my appointment to share her own experiences joining the Senate not too long before, offering a guiding hand and a gift of friendship. She was always and will always hold a special place in my heart, and she will be missed. <clears throat> Senator Foray Niesing served for just over three years, as we have heard. She was an ardent champion for minority language communities. She had a fierce commitment to truth and reconciliation. She was a defender of human rights, social justice, and substantive equality for all Canadians, in and outside the chamber. She was never one to let an opportunity pass to fight for the rights of the underrepresented. Colleagues, there are just some of the many ways that Senator Foray Niesing left her mark in pushing forward to a more just, equitable, and inclusive Canada. Jose wanted to be the best senator for Canadians, a proud legacy that we can all emulate. <clears throat> To Senator Foreni Singh's husband, Robert, and children, Veronique and Philippe, and to the rest of her family, friends, and to her community. We want you to know that she will be greatly missed here in the Senate and in our lives as well. We are not the same without her. <clears throat> to Jose, I am immensely grateful for the privilege to have known, worked, and learned from you. Tu me manques énormément, ma chère amie et collègue. Senator Coyle. 